welcome to another YouTube tutorial from Naim Bukhari YouTube channel so today we are going to discuss transport media what is it and for what purpose we usually uh, use transport media so in microbiology lab we usually need to transport samples uh, microbiological samples or specimens from one place to another place from one lab to another lab or from collection center to a laboratory where we usually perform microbiological tests so that's why we need uh, sometimes we need to transport samples uh, from one city to another city or from one country to another country and then to maintain proper temperature and to maintain proper uh, oxygen requirement or to maintain proper nutrient content we need to choose a proper transport media okay suppose there are some bacteria which are anaerobic in nature and they don't require any oxygen to survive if we will provide them oxygen then their growth pattern will be different so in such or for such bacteria we usually need to add a reducing agent like sodium thioglycate which can act as a anaerobic or reducing agent to remove oxygen from the medium and so anaerobic bacteria will survive in this uh, scenario okay so that's why sometimes we need transport media so moving forward what is transport media media used uh, for transporting samples means biological samples if we are going to transport biological samples or by uh, microbiological samples we need a transport medium Delicate uh, organism may not survive the time taken for supporting the specimen without a transport media means there are some delicate microorganisms, there are some small microorganism or some very important and who require only minor constituents or minor nutrients to survive or to degrade. So that's why we can say we need to have a particular support, uh, transport media for them. So first we will discuss uh, starch medium, starch medium non-nutrient uh, soft agar gel containing a reducing agent. So starch medium we have to use a nutrient agar or a nutrient medium hota hai. Jis mein basically agar ki semi solid media bhi isko kehte hain isme agar ki concentration 5 se 10% se bhi kam hoti hai aur hum log kya karte hain ki start medium mein reducing agent add karte hain reducing agents ka matlab ye hota hai ki that uh, agent will responsible to remove oxygen from the medium okay so aise medium mein non uh, anaerobic bacteria ko hi uh, transport kiya jata hai aur reducing agent includes like sodium thioglycate right Similarly, another media which is known as buffered glycerol saline enteric bacilli. Sometimes we need to grow enteric bacilli and we need buffered glycerol saline uh, as a transport media as well. Further, some important criteria of transport media means what are some important characteristics we usually opt for transporting uh, to maintain or to prepare a transport media. The following characteristics include like transport media should fulfill the following criteria one temporary storage of specimen being transported to the laboratory for cultivation the temporary energy or temporary nutrients provide kare your temporary stable condition sometimes we need this too that that media should not provide enough nutrients just uh, this media should provide survival conditions for the bacteria or microorganism maintain viability of microorganism viability means they are moving they are alive without altering their concentration contains only buffers and salts so buffer and salts add kiya jate hain jo ki just unki growth ko maintain karte hain but they are not supporting the bacteria in their multiplication or growth lack of carbon nitrogen and organic growth factors so to prevent microbial multiplication to jo hum log bas transport media hote hain usme organic nutrients ya inorganic nutrients ki kami hoti hai wo nahi add kiye jate taaki bacteria ki multiplication na ho balki just they will be surviving or they will be live such nutrients are only provided in a transport media transport media used in isolation of anaerobes must be free of molecular oxygen means there should be no oxygen uh, in a molecular form and in transport media usually a reducing agent is also added to remove if there is any sort of molecular oxygen uh, further based on oxygen requirements we classify like anaerobic media so in anaerobic medias are used to grow anaerobic organisms or microorganism anaerobic bacteria need special media for growth because they need low oxygen content as you people know reduced oxidation re reduction potential and extra nutrients so we usually add means uh, some reducing agents which on which not only uh, uh, reduce oxidation and reduction potential but also remove some extra nutrients as well media form anaerobes may have to be supplemented with nutrients like vitamin k so hum unme kuch vitamins bhi add karte hain vitamins add karne ka maqsad ye hota hai ki just uh, to improve the survival of the bacteria but not uh, to grow, go for their multiplication 
at a greater extent boiling the medium starts to expel any dissolved oxygen so if sometimes we uh, boil the media to remove any dissolved oxygen if there is any dissolved oxygen present within a media before inoculating microorganism on a transport media robustan uh, cooked meat medium thioglycate sodium or medium thioglycate medium mein hum basically ye reducing agent ke taur pe act karta hai jisko hum sodium thioglycate bhi kehte hain okay so here you can see an example like methylene blue strip indicator gas pack and anaerobic jar to yahan pe aapke paas ek media maujood hai usme aapne microorganism ko grow karwaya hai sorry add kiya inoculate kiya aur phir microorganism yahan pe just transport karne ke liye container use kiya jayega if there is change in color observed within the media it's mean uh, microorganism are going to multiply and we can know about or this will indicate that uh, this there was no proper uh, transport of the microorganism and tra the transport media was not beneficial or uh, of okay one for the growth of microorganism so if i will summarize i or i will sum up the whole lecture or whole idea so we can say a uh, transport media media is actually a medium where we usually uh, we usually prepare to transport uh, microorganism for from one place to another place and this media does not provide any organic or inorganic nutrient constituents but the media only provide uh, some support to the bacteria to just survive in uh, such kind of environment is only provided by the um, in the form of transport media so if you have any question regarding transport media how we use it so i can help you or if uh, so i would request you to subscribe my youtube channel and like and hit the bell icon if you have any question you can post your question in comment box and share your feedback in comments box as well stay blessed allah hafiz and bye bye